many have commented on the lack of a turn in this race course of monster trucks and then followed up that comment asking why is there no turn well honestly i don't know i have not seen a monster truck race on a turn so i can't tell you how that would go but other comments and other videos have suggested that it also goes pretty well Hey everybody, I'm Brendan, and I think Races and Fun will eventually add that feature. Werewolf and Bigfoot will get us started here in Group 3. And I think Races and Fun is thinking of adding the feature in a future tournament series. So look for monster trucks plus turns in the track. And of course that means a longer course. And I couldn't be more excited. I think Bigfoot's gonna cross there. Werewolf see on the near side. Low out of the crest at first hill. Let's keep it moving. Monto Sor no Motosaurus and the Hydra. Hydra, beautiful wheels. Green markings designating its aqua marine home and comes across just ahead. very wet lifestyle and will be seen later on in this one. Moving on, Bone Shaker and Bigfoot. Another Bigfoot coming out again. Jet black wheels to show for it. Bone Shaker wiggling and wobbling up through the hill and loses speed and Bigfoot almost falls off the track but he's going to come across and that's going to be a pretty simple win. And the replays are always amazing. Look at the oscillation of those wheels. The suspension that these cars must have. These trucks, you gotta call them. And that will be a win there in lane two. Look well, Really lane two of two, but uh, there's so many for this particular gate. <laughs> One through three can all be marked off and like this. Delivery and Bigfoot again. Here we go, big foot delivery there on the near side though, coming pretty fast and bounces out and almost loses it. And he's going to deliver himself to the next round. And only by a hair. Look at the air time these trucks get. That, that weight that they carry coming out of the high hills really must be a strong force to contend with if you happen to be standing at the end of that jump. Bowser and Race Ace. We get a Mario Kingdom, uh, Mushroom Kingdom look here as Bowser comes down. He's ahead by a length. I want to see him go to the next round and that he will not! Oh, I was about to end in a positive way there. But look at the comeback here. Bowser comes out pretty badly from the jump. He hits off the far side rail and the wheels on the near side go up into the air. He loses that speed. Oh, look at him. Oh, on one wheel there for a second. And it's going to be lane one here or lane five by the gate. Actually holding through. Barely. Bigfoot and the Radiated Scorpion. What a name and what a wheel design. And what a car body. I don't know how that has any, uh, any aerodynamic ability. And clearly, uh, wow. And he's going to get wrecked right there out of the jump. Almost off camera. Would have liked to have seen that. Maybe get a replay look on how that looked. But <laughs> I think, well, Radiated Scorpion is no more. As a replay look. We only got the one car on camera. But maybe we'll get a look at that. That wipeout. Here they come down the hill, looking pretty straight, and they get some air. Not a lot of air time, and oh, what is he hitting? And it's out of the jump. Oh, he must have hit something right there on the rail that kind of was sticking out because that just really put him out of balance. Donkey Kong, another look from the Mushroom Kingdom. The monster come out again with bright blue wheels. Here comes Donkey Kong, Mushroom Kingdom, looking to get one car into the finals, and he will not. And oh, Donkey Kong's gonna wipe out in likeness. And at least look at the best shot. Maybe we might see another Mushroom Kingdom car later on. But right now, this is not really where they're gonna shine. Oh, 
Moving on. Bigfoot and the Roger Dodger. Hmm, haven't heard that name in a while. It's been quite a while. As I just said. <laughs> Since the Roger Dodger has appeared, I think way back in maybe last year, 2021, Roger Dodger is going to move on to the next round. Might even have been 2020. I forget when I started with this channel. It was way back during the pandemic period. Someone get a, maybe a lead on it. I can hear some comments kind of reminding me when the first time. Was it in 2020? It might have been. And the Roger Dodger hasn't appeared since then, is what I'm saying. Advancing to the next round, we got eight trucks. No Mushroom Kingdoms to be seen. Next round. Bigfoot the Monster. Bunch of Bigfoots out there. The monster would like to cut off one of them from victory. Here comes the monster out by almost a length through the crest, but slow up the hill, and Bigfoot's gonna have it. And now I'm starting to wonder whether fast out of the gate is uh, often equating to slow up the hill. I don't know why that would be. Maybe some uh, monster truck experts can cast some light on that in the comments, but I mean, it seems like the faster you start, the tougher it is to get up that hill and be strong through the crest. Monster will come across. Not too far behind, but far enough behind that he won't be going to the finals. Ray Sace in the delivery. Here we go, race ace, delivery, delivery, coming out fast, and look up the crest of the hill, the race ace coming back to center again, and it's close to the end, but I think that was the delivery, held through, so just, I mean, almost, I'd say, put a pin in my theory, because the race ace did make quite a comeback up the hill, because down about uh, one to even two lengths out of the gate, but the delivery was fast and had a lot of air time on the jump, look how far he got out there, and uh, it was close down at the end. Could have been the race ace's game if he didn't skid through that rail at the end. You see that? And it's going to be the delivery to the next round. Hydra, Bigfoot. Hydra. Here on the near side. They both about even out of the gate. So even through the crest. Interesting how that works out in Hydra. By a wheel length. Remember, that is quite a bit of... <laughs> Distance when you consider how big monster truck wheels are. But still, we have to quantify it somehow, and wheel length works in this case. And there we go. Bounces through the finish. Roger Dodger and the Bigfoot again. Favoring the Roger Dodger here just because of the nostalgia of it all back where I started. Roger Dodger, ooh, slow through the crest. Tries to make up the ground, but just kind of falls flat through the second jump. I almost call it a second jump because that first hill, you do see a little bit of a jump some air time out of there, maybe. Um, as they fall down, they get a little bit of separation from the track. It's really the only jump of the course. But no matter, Roger Dodger is way far behind as he heads to that much. Moving on. Advancing to finals. These four trucks in front of you. A bunch of Bigfoots in the delivery. And I think the race ace in there as well. Don't forget to subscribe. We will see you next time in races and fun as we move closer to crowning the monster truck king.